to our hotel. It's huge, dude. It's so large. It is bigger than I thought because like you could literally fit a whole family. Yeah. We got two, two queen two. beds. You could fit two. A whole full body mirror, bro. This is gonna be lit for outfit checks. Four, Where's the bathroom? Six. You could fit like seven people in here. That's crazy. Eight people we want to come to. It's a pretty simple bathroom, but it's nice. There's a lot of vanity space so we can get ready. Ooh, nice. nice. Finest dinner that <laughs> money can buy. <laughs> oh, it looks so sad. <laughs> I didn't get a bagel. <laughs> yeah. We stayed here last night. And then we rechecked in this morning. We went and got breakfast. And then we just picked up our like little wristband box. Here we go. I hear all the goodies in there and I'm so excited. Um, but we got a shuttle pass. And then of course we got our little wristbands here. There's like a little, oh, it's like holographic. That's cool. You can see the shift in there. And we got Coachella sticker here. That's cute. This one. Look at it. Oh, what is cute. that? <laughs> it's a little Coachella pin. We got two lost and found property tags. So you attach this to like your bag or something. And if somebody finds it, then they'll scan it and like get a hold of you. Okay. Coachella day one outfits. Her outfit is from Ross and what? Nicole's pumpkin. Okay. The pumpkin patch and then I am wearing by Bambi like shorts and combat boots and then I have a whole bunch of like pink bows in my hair. We're very different. <laughs> but we're gonna go get on this shuttle. We're super excited. Our wristbands. She did her nails too. Mine don't really match my outfit today. You can't really see them. Wow. <laughs> we're so ready. check in here it is so freaking hot here it's like a hundred and something degrees so i put my hair up um we are checking out like all the fun studios like there's the coke studio we just did an electrolyst studio pinterest is over here um we saw like a few neutrogena sunscreen stands which is also really nice um we're just kind of walking around and exploring until we find out or er, until we go to watch the last dinner party at the Japanese house and Sabrina Carpenter tonight um, and whoever else we stumble up on.
and Sabrina. Um, Michaela left like 15 minutes early and is, um, oh my goodness, is, she went to go see Deftones. So I think I'm gonna get some lemonade and then catch up with her um, to see the rest of Deftones set. And then I think we're gonna just kind of walk around Coachella for a bit, maybe try and find our locker and then go see Lana. Day one of Coachella has ended. Um, I am so, so tired and <laughs> ready to go to bed. Um, luckily, we don't have to be at any shows until like 3 p.m., 4 p.m. tomorrow. So that'll be so good to sleep in. Um, Kale's in the shower. I took off my makeup and I am going to sleep. So good night. I will see you on day two. Okay, we're on day two of Coachella. <laughs> you can't really see the outfit. <laughs> Hold on, let me lower it a little bit more. There we go, kind of. Wearing some boots, basically everything is from Forever 21. Um, and then her outfit. <laughs> um, <clears throat> it is rough out here. I'm so sleepy. But you wouldn't believe that I slept all day, so. <laughs> We're headed in to Coachella day two. It's like 3 p.m. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Coachella is one of the craziest things. Everyone is in their influencer era. And I love seeing all the digital cameras out. <laughs> I think that's so cute for some reason. But the views are honestly probably the best part of Coachella for me. The sunsets, the Ferris wheel. Just, it's a gorgeous venue. Look at this. I haven't told her yet. I'm gonna market this. 
temperature and people. That's what I think. Okay. Everyone in here is hot as bleep, bleep. Everyone here is so fine, so scrum delicious. They are killing it in their outfits. That's what I gotta say. Okay. Coachella, land of the hot. <laughs> Coachella we are so freaking excited so here's a final outfit check we've got a 70s vibe going on for me today basically all from forever 21 Shein and then I've got my born boots with my bandana attached to the boot and then for you Ross boots and I found this in my closet and then she's most looking forward to Taking Back Sunday. Taking Back Sunday. And of course, I am excited for Renee Rapp. This is my favorite thing about festivals that we go together, though, is I get to learn about your music <laughs> and you get to learn about my music, but we both enjoy each other's music, I feel yeah. like. Like, the vibes are all good at the festival, so I think it's super fun. And then we associate those memories with the music. So we're so excited for the final day, but we're also so, so sad. Um, but yeah, it's one o'clock. We gotta get going.
over tonight. I'm so sad. We got some dinner. Pulled pork, mac and cheese. Yum. Hello you guys! So I wanted to go ahead and end the vlog here. Um, as you could probably tell, I am sick. I was so sick at Coachella like the entire time. I kind of went to Coachella like a little under the weather so I already was not feeling good and then definitely after the festival I was so sick if you know you know it's called the festival flu Coachella cough whatever you want to call it um it happens literally at, at any festival you go to there's just a whole bunch of people dust is flying around you're bound to get sick um so yeah so literally our whole drive back from um Palm Desert to New Mexico was a 10 hour drive and Michaela and I the first time that we went to Palm Desert we split it in half so she drove five hours and then I drove the last five hours um, but I was so sick I had a fever that she actually ended up driving the whole 10 hours um, back home to New Mexico so I literally slept that whole time and then when we got home I also <laughs> slept and then yesterday she slept all day and I just like sat and watched movies um, so yeah, we have just been both down bad since getting back from the vacation. Um, but now I am at the Albuquerque airport and I am on my way back home. So I'm excited to go back home and kind of just decompress. Um, this Coachella was after Dior passed away. So if you don't know, Dior passed away right before I went to Coachella. So I am excited to go home and not excited to go home. Um, it's gonna be very, very depressing being back in my house. Um, I haven't been able to like grieve him. I've been thinking about him literally this entire vacation. Um, it's been probably one of the best times and the worst times in my life right now. Um, just like losing a cat that I had a, such a special bond with, but also um, doing one of the biggest things on my bucket list like ever um, and achieving one of my dreams which is going to Coachella so it's been kind of just a wide range of emotions and this whole like week just has not felt real and it's flown by um, just an incredible and a surreal experience overall um, but I really I I greatly um, missed you are i missed that cat so so much he's he was literally 
my best friend even though I only had him for a year it literally felt like I had him my whole life so um, kind of a little bit of mixed emotions going back home but excited to be back home just to like be in the comfort of my own bed and sleeping <laughs> um, but I do work at 5 30 in the morning tomorrow and I won't get home till about midnight tonight so I have a long long day ahead of me um, but yeah Coachella was super fun I don't feel like I really checked in and talked about like what my overall experience was about Coachella I can do an entirely separate video on that just because this is going to get way too long if I sit here and talk about like my Coachella experience so I will do a separate video on that um but I had an absolute freaking blast and I'm so excited for you guys to see all this footage um and I hope you guys enjoy it so yes I will see you guys in the next one please don't forget to hit that like button hit that subscribe button turn on that notification bell if you want to be notified of the next time that I upload a video Thank you guys so much for watching and supporting me. I love you guys so much.